Hi, I'm Grandpa Gary, and I just got here, and uh, it was such a beautiful day today, I thought I'd bring out uh, the Extra 300 by E-Flight. I love this airplane, and of course everybody knows my mom bought this for me for my birthday, so I love flying this airplane, and uh, so I just thought I'd bring it out. This is actually a second flight today. I flew earlier this morning on the pond with the float. It's on the UMX Timber X, and that was a lot of fun, but because I flew first thing in the morning, I thought, hey, I'll get out and fly again tonight, and uh, of course, you guys will watch this video another day, but boy, it was it's pretty awesome to get out here twice in one day, and uh, I just love the extra 300. Let's get this thing in here and see what I can do. All right, high rates. That'll cut off. And uh, of course, safe is off. And because I got um, a separate channel assigned to the one aileron, safe doesn't affect that one, but that's okay. We're not going to use safe. And. There is like no wind, so we're just gonna take off that direction. And uh, we got all of this open field. They're, they're practicing the peewee football back there, so I'm in the middle of the park today. Let's do it. Back off the throttle a little bit. I'll bring this around. Boy, it feels like it's on rails today. Still haven't got that knife edge perfected. Ooh, flirting with those soccer goals for sure. Guess I should have looked around a little closer before I took off. Boy, the bottom of that wing with the dark goldish yellow and black checkerboard scheme sure does have a serious contrast compared to the top of the wing. No issues telling which way it's facing. Carrying a little more speed, I'm able to do that aileron with no problem. Just having some fun today, guys. I'm actually still getting used to this airplane. So that's why I am doing a lot of this a little bit higher than normal. Well, sometimes when you see a guy come out of a stall and and roll it like that he's just trying to figure out which way it's facing and uh, that's what I was doing right there is I was just making sure that I had the top towards me and was able to pull under at the bottom of the ball This airplane is flying so good. Staying a little bigger with the invert.
Nice low aileron roll. Bringing it back around over the top. One thing that I was, one of the maneuvers that I love doing with these type of airplanes is the maneuver where you go up at an angle and then roll it over and then pull it under. That's one of my f absolute favorite maneuvers and the guys used to do this all the time at the flying field when I was growing up. This one will take me a while to get where I'm comfortable even attempting doing point rolls because of not being as comfortable with that aileron or aileron the knife edge is just not very latched in for me nice and easy coming out of that one little more aggressive and uh, rolling out of the loop a little snap roll at the top of the loop Carrying some speed as we try to do the knife edge again. Not too bad there. I just got to give it a little more rudder than I'm used to. Love to be able to get this just a little bit lower. Carrying some speed as I do the bank turn. And of course, we'll do the Warbird turn. Rolling out and then turning in. Well, it looks really good when you do it. That aggressive, fast roll. One more of the snaps at the top, rolling to the straight. Really nice. Getting more comfortable with that knife edge. I was sitting on the rudder just a little bit going into it and I got it to try to stall on me. Close. That was really close. Still climbing as I'm afraid to let it sit, but my timer is starting to count down. So one more try here. All right, we'll bring it in for landing from right to left. Full off power, letting it ease in here. Nicely. Nicely done, Gary. You can see the grass isn't exactly short here. <laughs> so the extra 300 cutting through the grass okay. Even with the wheel pants, it had enough power to take off. And... Um, Man, I just love flying this airplane. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the flight today. Man, I'm just having fun with RC every day. And uh, for such a beautiful, beautiful day today, big thank you to the Lord. And uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying the weather as much as I am today. And uh, hopefully RC too. 
And I uh, appreciate everybody's support, especially those uh, that have gone the extra mile and are helping me through Patreon and memberships. But uh, like somebody pointed out, even the people watching the videos are huge. That is the most important piece of when it comes to YouTube is the people watching the videos. And I do appreciate it so very much. Until next time, I'm Grandpa Gary, and I just got here.